How you doing? I'm good. I don't have to go to the gym tonight. Wasn't going anyways, but I don't have to anymore. <laughs> so damn close. We have a customer who's out there. In 2.6 miles, turn left to merge onto I-80. Can we do that? Yeah, no worries. <laughs> <laughs> This customer I was out to yesterday had his meter replaced by the water company. The valve started leaking, so we're going back out there today to change that valve. And he's got a bunch of other valves that are the old style stop and waste valves. So we're gonna go out there today, locate the curb box that we can't find outside. We can try to use the metal detector, see if we can catch the metal head of the curb box, but we'll get it done. I found out DeWalt makes Garden tools now. Saw them at Home Depot. Just not any Home Depot within 100 miles of here. So what's up with that, DeWalt? <laughs> Just so it goes with my collection. Would have had DeWalt. If they had a broom, I would've got that. <laughs> I had a flat shovel and this pointed shovel. Come on, DeWalt. I know you were disappointed. I was disappointed. Just yeah, so we we're just trying to find the curb box, which is the tapping main shutoff from the road to the house. So the curb box rises up so that we can easily get to it. The problem with this one was it was buried and it is a tight fit. So it was a su success finding it, but whether or not we're gonna get onto it, that's gonna be the next thing. A few inches later. I think the conclusion is we have to dig. I get to get a workout in. We want to pump you up. Digging holes in the yard, digging holes. Digging holes in the yard, digging holes. Gonna catch me. This just and the more than I was hoping for. Oh yeah, now we're getting to that. I just can't tell how it would be locked around if it is, but it won't let go. What happened is the curb valve is full of dirt. The line, we dug it all up, couldn't get the curb box off. It's locked onto there. Basically we were told with that style of valve that there's an issue where they rust together and not getting them off. So at this point, it's beneficial just to replace a valve. Um, so I'm marking off our call before you dig right now. And we'll come back out, we'll dig it up, replace the valve, and then we can continue on with the work inside. So, it's been an eventful day. Day two. What's up? What's up? What are you doing today, Lou? So, we're digging up the water valve, main water valve shutoff for the house. Um, right now, we're trying to find the electric, the utilities, so that we don't hit it with the machine. That'd be a bad day. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The main valve, the curb valve, is responsibility of the water department, but the curb box, which is the tube that rises up through the ground, this is the homeowner's responsibility. So we have to dig that, take the curb box off, and then see if the valve moves. Then we can replace the shutoff valves inside on the meter, which was the original call for us being out here. This stuff that I'm doing now is just extra old valves that he chose to update as well while we were already here. So I'm doing what I can while they do what they can do outside. That's what I like to call get it done, son. Old valve, new valve. Old valve, new valve. All that work for this. All right, we are all wrapped up. We were able to get the curb box off. Valve was able to turn. So shut off the main, replaced all the valves inside as needed. New curb box is on. Should have no issues with that in the future. Uh, all backfilled, cleaned up. We're 
Mm. All done. Just in time. It's starting to rain. Mm. Yeah. All right. We'll see you next time. Mm. George gets to watch me work. You have to stand there. I should have been a camera guy. What, you think it's easy to be a camera guy? So far, it's been pretty easy. <laughs> oh. <laughs>